hopefully not. Hopefully not, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, first one, Jepuski, and who else? Mods are there. Please uh, tell people to refresh their page. I'm back. So it should work now. Should. Sure. Knocks on the wood. I know. Say something. No, I don't. Uh, it also says that it skips frames, so is the stream itself working extremely shitty, or is everything fine? <sighs> Hi Francis, how are you today? Looks good, okay. Fair plus. Seems fine to you, okay, that's good to hear. <sighs> this is bad. This is really bad. Also, how is crew fun today? As if I chose! Game, as if I chose! You're on Ritz app on PS4. No need to refresh. You framed it. I sent it on Discord. Okay. Do we have enough souls so it counted as the boss as killed one or not? So I got to say I'm not sure. Okay, we can teleport away so I can take it as it counted as we killed it, but... Another day with the sea. Technical problems. So yes. Definitely need to be asking some help with it later on since now it seems that Dixper wasn't the issue. Science like yeah, every issue completely disappeared after I deleted the expert. Like really, really everything just disappeared and I thought that it's gonna work. But now it seems like the issues are back. Pick the vice beasts. So makes me fear that the memory might be damaged or it's the power. And neither of them sound like a good thing. That sucks. Back to troubleshooting then. Yeah. Oh, damn it. So, ideas are more than welcome. This point. Sometimes, yeah, I'm I'm lost. Probably have to try to many 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 things. Great title, Sean. Did you run a man test to check the RAM is full? Uh, the run. I think it was the memory test. Yeah, I think. Oh no no, it was the hard drive test, like uh, RT OK. Congratulations Thompson, you did well, I'm proud of you. So yeah, I will definitely need help with that. Uh, well, thankfully I'm off tomorrow, so... Ideas to fix are more than welcome with that matter. Mm. 
and you don't know too much on the computer stuff, but you can ask a friend to see if there is any solution. There probably is. It's just like a... Someone knows something I definitely would love to hear. Oh yeah, I'm keeping the memory, not the memory, to like, um, there is all the time the temperatures are on my another monitor, so checking out if they cause issues, but it seems like they are on normal all the time, so far at least, no issues with them. But the memory test definitely is something I need to do. And possibly try to reattach them as well. That's one of the things. Okay, did we get the map for it? No, it doesn't give me a map for great three beasts. You would think they are somewhere nearby, right? right. Hi Werner, how are you today? Okay, mostly tired. Now I'm just super, super, super worried. Have you got all the most recent patches? Yes, and um, all my drivers are updated, my Windows is up to date, and all that. But you're here, so no more worries. Yeah, it's just PC stuff again, so you always bring luck. I hope so. Okay, investigate. <laughs> Take your time. Oh, freaking hell. Like every time when it's about PCs, it's driving me crazy and more scared than anything else. It's the thing that they use for work, streaming, drawing, everything. Because Windows things are really a few. The thing is, like, I'm not sure even is it Windows. Okay, let me actually check something. Uh, let's hope that my game doesn't crash meanwhile. Okay. I constantly have issues. Well, some sort of issues, but they are not good issues if the PC itself crashes. That's bad. That is like really fucking bad. Oh no. Keep the one. Oh. Okay. Okay. So it's again, it says it's the. The previous system shutdown was unexpected. Well, thank you. Why it happened? No idea. And the critical, uh, critical kernel boot. No. Okay. Error. The storage optimizer couldn't complete. Also, I changed my windows into in, uh, English. Uh, I haven't disabled the Steam overlay, no. Uh, but I'm checking where the errors are. <laughs> it says, I don't fucking get it. What it fucking means with this? Um, 
Because like I changed my windows to English so people would be able to understand me when I'm trying to explain what is going on. And it still says it's half English and half Finnish. And it doesn't make any sense. What the fuck? Uh, but basically it doesn't... It can't for some reason... Oh my god, I'm gonna get a headache from this. Mm. At least it's not French. Oh, well, that's true. Um... So basically the D and E disks hard drives. I I have hard time to explain this because it's half English and half Finnish and I don't fucking know how what it fucking means. But um what the fuck is varmuuskopiointi in English? Can you make a Windows backup for to a latest version? No, because that one also had issues. Um but yeah. Does any Finnish people know what it is in English? I can't. My brains are dying. Fucking hell. Anxiety is creating. I always keep my windows up to date, but no, it has already had the issues in the or older version as well. Type it how they say it. The thing is, it doesn't make sense. You can look it up. Uh. I feel like it's already made in Google Translator, so it still would make sense. Mint Windows 11 or still Windows 10? Still Windows 10. But yeah, the only thing that I need is the... What is Varmuuskopiointi in English? Fucking hell. My English is betraying me, so one second. Uh, stop panicking. Okay. Maybe install also does wonders, but it's annoying. Werner, it already got clean in Windows installation. So, I don't think that also fixes it, because it doesn't seem to fix it. Where is Finn when we need him now? I'm ready soon. Good question. Mm -hmm. uh, backup, okay, yeah. So basically for some reason it cannot uh, run the backups for the hard drives. Hi Tarna, how are you today? But when I checked out the freaking hard drives, they were fine. <sighs> Can't run while like not support or something. Uh, that's a straight final lesson. I don't know what it would be otherwise. Because as I said, it's half Finnish and half English. And if you turn it to translator, it makes it that way. You're doing good, happy to hear? That's some good sleep. Oh, nice. Maybe it's just part of the game. It says another boss. But it has happened with another games as well. With this as well. And like, yeah, originally every time when it did something fucking weird like that, it was um, basically the event viewer said that Dixper has crashed. So I deleted Dixper. But now it seems like, well, it still does it, even though I deleted Dixper. So, like, all the issues stopped it for a week after I deleted Dixper. Did you update your tribe? Everything is up to date. All the drivers are up to date. Where the fuck is the bear? Yeah, it is. It is suspicious. Very damn suspicious. More than tall, kind of like this in the village. This place. Oh, here is Ritz and K. It's just funny. No, I don't want brand new PC. No, because it's one that I built on my own. And it has worked perfectly so far. Just recently updated it and fucked up completely my whole money situation though because of it, but... If there is no way to solve the problem, maybe a computer reset to the buffered options will help.
As I said, I already reinstalled Windows completely since the very beginning. And that did not fix issues. Well, we was looking for a reason Elden Ring game is crashing, so it's happening with other games. No, no, no! It's not just the game. It's just not the game. My whole PC crashed. It just uh, shut itself down immediately. No any kind of error noises, nothing. It just boop, and it was closed. And then it restarted itself immediately. Temperatures are perfect. You think you are now going last boss of this game? Not going to spoil anything. Okay, I wish you the best luck if you're going. Have fun. Don't break anything. I think the tree is wise piece. By the way, if the blue screen of the app ends with backup error, it might also be other errors. No, still no blue screens. No. Okay, so. I need to kill those. Uh, so the temperatures are perfectly fine. My drivers, everything, Windows is up to date. The same issue have happened already before with original Windows as well. There is no error noises, nothing. It just closes my PC and restarts it immediately. No blue screens, nothing. Originally, when it did the same thing, it said that Dixper couldn't update, so I deleted Dixper. But now I don't have the expert anymore, and it says Gernel boot something. For some mysterious reason, uh, it says everything half English, half Finnish, even though my Windows is in completely English. Maybe there is a dead bug on the one of the connections. Could be. Also, like um, PC itself have been upgraded very recently, and as I said, like Windows have been reinstalled and yeah, straight up shut down and restart. Yes. Think it's GPU. Right. Uh, siis tuo... Näytö ohjainko. Sleep mode is on. Nope. Disabled. No sleeping for PC. Hey, now the oh yeah, processor. But I just fucking. Changed it. Processor is like fucking month old or so. So that sucks if it's broken already. That sucks like fucking big time. <sighs> and like if I would have to take it to computer hospital, that would mean that I wouldn't be able to stream until I get new one. And something that has electric panel of the computer, something like power source to make the computer restart. I don't know, shouldn't, because like everything is in the same thingy, so it would affect everything else as the uh, computer as well. Keeping your fingers crossed, it is not that, yeah. I do hope it is not. It sounds like you haven't much thermal base in GPU. But wouldn't that affect on the temperatures then? Yeah, temperatures are freaking perfect. So 
So wouldn't it affect on the temperatures if there would be too little thermal paste? Uh, BIOS is updated as well. Everything is up to date. So you can think of only three things when the PC restart without warning. My hardware issue or cable issue. Check the cables are loose inside. That I have already checked out. Driver issue not working correctly. Mobile or antivirus on the GPS. Mm, at least so far I haven't managed to find any malwares from it. Nor any epic viruses either. Say the driver not update perfectly. Oh, <gasps> skeletons! Thank you for the follow up. Receiving maybe it's just shutting down because it can't handle how awesome you are. <laughs> that would suck. How do you try to re update the driver? I have. I have. Because this, this is the same th uh, stuff that we already went through the last time when we had these issues. Because this issue has now continued for a while. It's just down because of the queen is breaking things. Yeah, I just wish I would break a little bit lesser expensive stuff. Because I can't afford on this kind of fuck ups. I can't. And it's fucking scaring me. Find a beast. Where the beasts are? <sighs> when the first turn off, see if it still happens. Yes. But it is not something that happens daily, it's more of a weekly or... Closer. Go to the far club, find computer expert, tell them to kiss on the cheek if they fix your PC. No, no. Hell no, I ain't letting a random touch to my PC, no. Only it happened when you play game, right? Uh, no, it has also happened like when there is nothing going on in the background, like nothing at all. Right? Uh, no, I actually can't. No. How the fuck am I supposed to kill that? What the fuck? What? Oh my god, fucking kill it. How in the fucking earth they expect me to fucking kill him? Oh, fuck, fuck. <sighs> How the fuck that torture is climate driven? He will say this while not ideal. The issue is not end of the world, you think. It's not an emergency level. It is already on emergency level if it starts like causing that my PC closes down suddenly without any kind of warning. Because that might cause more issues and it might damage something badly. You also 100% sure you will figure it out and get it fixed. I actually won't. That's the thing. I know I keep saying I'm bad at things. I know I say that I suck at video games. Well, 
that's completely different because when it comes to something as a software or something like that, I'm completely fucking useless. I'm not even joking about it. Like, I really don't know anything about it. I would want to, but I just don't. How the fuck did that turn? Yeah, we the same stuff, okay. That happened to you last time when your power supply being bad. Yeah, I do hope that if it's something broken, I hope it's a power supply, but at the same time, like... Yeah, no idea. Also, now it's not in the same tree anymore. What the fuck? Am I supposed to, like, refine it? Okay. Okay, let's try that first. So what kind of stuff it eats? Okay. But yeah, when it's about uh, things like uh, software, I suck at it. Your money is either on the power supply or run. Yeah. Right. I just really, 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 really hope that it's nothing that costs money. He was hoping you weren't in the same boat as you. Like, I have said uh, it before, I can build PC, no big deal, I can do stuff like that. But it, when it comes to the software, it's like... Like freaking mind arranged Chinese for me, I can't fucking read it, I can't understand it. I can destroy it. Because if power supply, PC will not turn on. Uh, it can, it can, but it also can, like, um, break itself, I guess. That would actually make sense quite a more, and it was one of the first things that I thought when it started it. But okay, uh, any ideas where the tortoises are? Need to find them. The laptop did that few times too, it just turned itself off for no apparent reason. Took out of the butter, waited 10 minutes, put it back and turned back on. Worked fine, it did that about 5 times, 2 times this time, and never again since. Weird. Very weird. See, it was still better tech and you haven't built your own PC and would never need how to do it. It's not that hard to build it, but yeah, software is like it just isn't my strongest ability to do that. Hope you get PC. Yeah, PC building is actually quite a relaxing and fun. Well, mm, AMD building is. Uh, Intel wasn't so much because it was so stressful to put that damn thing on the processor. AMD. Not big D. Intel, you are super afraid that you fucking cut those small fucking needles and everything will go horribly wrong and... Where is the final one? Seriously, where is it? The fucking three again? You have a laptop? It's brand new. How many computers do you... <gasps> oh dear. Yeah, I'm sure you will survive with it. Okay, if somebody sees a freaking blue turtle, please say. On your battery no longer charges up, you have to have a power cord in the whole time or it won't. Hmm. That is weird. AMD, yeah. Like I had originally, the first PC that I built on my own was Intel PC. I did like it. But as I said, like the building was quite a... It was stressful on that matter because you have to press it differently than the AMD. And now when I built the AMD one, Oh, it was so nice and so little scary thing to do. Like, no presser. That's it. Just press it there. T Need a hand? Yes, please. If you see the final freaking turtles, because like, at the moment I'm just panicking and I, I can't fucking focus. It does have a different... Yeah, it has. They do have a quite a bit of differences. What the fuck is it? Like what? 
Uh, do you mean like uh, how they work differently or how they are set up differently? You haven't been here, but did you get uh, one climbing a tree? Yeah, we shot the one that was climbing a tree. They work. Another one is better for multitasking and another one was it like video encoding and such. I just don't remember which one was which one. I think AMD was better for multitasking, but I could be wrong. There's one on that side that is down the cliff. AMD is better for multitasking. Okay, then I better look down from above. Okay. Okay, then I remember, right? Yeah. But it's close to the wall. Okay. Don't ask good single core performance. But Intel also like to hit up. I think well, AMD also had to think, at least back in the time when I built the first PC of mine. It also had the, like, um, because then I chose, oh, there it is, chose not to take the AMD because I used to live with someone who built PCs on his own, and he said that AMD ones get way hotter, way faster than Intel ones. This was one of the reasons why I chose Intel for the first one. The brother is planning to buy a PC that was like, no, don't buy it. You have to build it yourself because it's no much fun. And we'll see if he will do it for a PC. Yeah, and also like building your own PC, it's easier to upgrade it and you know keep it up with the stuff. Because like, well, for example, in a couple of years, if you have a older PC, it might not even like run the games anymore. But if it's your built one, you just change some parts and ta ta works again. You about to leave to help some friends move, cut feet. Have fun, good luck. Thank you, and still thank you for all the help, really appreciate it. Hopefully you have a nice day, and hopefully the moving goes as easy as possible. Good luck. And of course, thanks for stopping by, I appreciate it. Hopefully we'll see you later again. Memory slots. Build it your own, makes it more valuable for yourself, and take care more of it, and it's cheaper. I'm not sure about the cheaper part, especially now when the... What the fuck they are called? The freaking prices are high up. Everything that my PC has eaten can be found under the info panel. 